guys how are you doing so these are the features coming to your airpods pro after ios 18 release which is expected to happen by the end of september to be specific for airpods pro second generation with lightning case or usb-c these three features are going to come and among that only one feature is expected to arrive for the airpods pro first generation for the airpods pro third generation and earlier models there is no new features added and the very first feature is you now have to simply nod your head yes or no in order to accept or you know decline the incoming phone call when Siri announces the calls when you are wearing the airpods on your ears. This is called hands-free Siri interactions and with the first iOS 18 developer beta that option is not yet available. The setting is not yet available and it is not working yet and I'm expecting you know in a couple of betas we may be seeing that toggle you know added to the airpods settings once it's connected the second important feature coming to your airpods pro uh, which is also believed to come you know to the first generation of airpods pro is voice isolation as per the apple support document other two features are you know very specific to airpods pro second generation maybe due to hardware limitations but the first generation is also getting the voice isolation feature which came during the ios 16 updates you know only for the iPhones like when you use the mic and the speaker on the iPhone you were able to use the voice isolation feature during the phone call FaceTime call you know either video or audio call and also during the WhatsApp call third-party apps uh, API also available so you know any other application that supports simply you can turn on the voice isolation mode to deliver a better audio clarity focused on your voice when you are talking to your friends and this feature was working also with the previous AirPods Pro first generation as per my understanding and I think Apple have finally made it official you know to support with the AirPods Pro also uh, uh, previously it was sound you know kind of uh, a robotic voice and now they have made some improvements I believe to make it official and you know su supporting both the airpods pro first generation and the second generation the same way you can control this from the menu system available in the control center the next one is spatial audio api is now open for game developers so games now you can enjoy spatial audio with your iphone or ipad while wearing the airpods pro second generation there is no mention about the first generation for this feature to work and due to that airpods pro second generation will have a better latency while gaming the next one is enhanced dialogue mode comes to the apple tv application when you use the airpods pro second generation and that option is available within the apple tv menu system like when you watch a video or a tv show on your apple tv you can select that enhanced dialogue and based on the scenes you will hear the audio better with little bit adjustment to the background you know the surrounding audio in that video all other options are going to be same and i also noticed some pull down arrow kind of menu i know when i long press and enter into the airpods settings menu quick access menu from the control center and i think this could be added in you know for some reason uh, maybe removed in upcoming betas because right now that is not you know performing any actions when i tap on it it simply turns off and shows the turn on and off conversational awareness and the spatial audio feature so apart from that upcoming ios 18 beta releases will even fine tune it before it is officially released by the end of september to all the comparable iphone and ipad models thanks for watching and if you find this information useful don't forget to subscribe have a wonderful day